got a quick word for you today. The Spirit of the Lord would tell you to stop worrying about the time. I was in service earlier and I just heard the Spirit of the Lord share with me, stop worrying about the time. And that was a message for those of you who catch this. You have been so concerned and almost consumed about feeling like it's too late. Will it ever happen for you? You felt behind time. You felt beyond time, like it is past. And the Lord is saying, don't put a period where I have placed a comma. Stop worrying about the time. I will give it to you to stand still. And the Bible says this in Joshua chapter number 10, verses number 13 and 14. It talks about how Joshua told the son to and steal. And God is saying, because of the word over your life, he's going to cause there to be time for the things that you've been believing for. You're getting ready. Not that it's going to happen, but it's going to happen now. This is the time of it to unfold before you now is the opportune time now is the set time saith the lord now is the appointed time that's what moed means opportune means kairos that's what time it is and he's reminding me of isaiah chapter number 60 verse number 22 and it says at the set time at the appointed time at the right time i the lord will make it happen and there's another a version of scripture that says and he will not only make it happen but he will make it happen swiftly now is the appointed time so stop worrying about the time he's going to cause it to stand still until you come through you come out you are on the other side with everything that he's ever spoken and promised over your life now is the time for it to happen in multiples in jesus name so be it unto you stop worrying now it's just time to worship the warrior that you are it's time for you to war in worship, in praise, honor, and thanksgiving because the same God who did it before is getting ready to do it again. And you shall see the goodness of God in the land of the living. God bless you. Love you much. See you soon.